much history. What a great atmosphere here tonight. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. The Red Wings get off to a good start as they win the opening faceoff. Detroit's got him along the wall. Turned aside with that glove by Sensonov. Oh, and another beauty stop right there. Moves it to Sider. Trying to escape the pressure. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. The Red Wings scoop it up along the boards. Battling for the puck, but still hangs on. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still scoreless in this one. The Leafs get a hold of the draw. The Red Wings gain possession. Here's a short pass to Perron. Pokes it away in his own end. Detroit's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Gets a piece of it to make the save. Well, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. Perron's got the puck in his own zone. Slides the pass over to Sherratt. Detroit's on the attack. The Red Wings gonna work on offense. How did he stop that one? I really like this save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Passes it to Fisher. And he loses control here. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Giordano. Domi's got it into offensive territory. Scoops up the puck. Fabry's got it in the defensive end. Slick feed. And he slides it quickly to Fisher. That's a great heads up play to break up the pass. Oh, making his presence felt with the hit. The cliche in hockey is you want to start the game hard and physical and really set the tone, and that's what he was doing right there. have it from their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Quick shot! That goes out between. And now it's grabbed by Larkin. Dishes it to Raymond. Slides the puck ahead to Larkin. Quick pass to Dabrinkin. Denies him! Samsonov's all over that save. I mean, he's dialed in and he recognizes where he has to be at the right time. Moves it quickly over to Gostaspar. And a solid save on the play there. Trying to get back on the attack now. Toronto's got it across the line. Cut grab by Klingberg. Oh, what a glove save by Husso. Well, we know he's got a great glove hand, and man, does he ever show it off right there with that stop. Takes a shot. Scores! Detroit's finally opened the scoring here in the first. Now let's see how both teams respond, right, Cheryl? Yeah, and I think this is a product of just playing the game differently and having a different mindset. They started the game, they were hesitant, almost as if you're playing just to keep it close and not to lose. You gotta play to win the game, and they've really opened it up in the latter half of this period. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Gets the puck in deep. The Leafs have it now. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Sends it over to Chances nice and tight to the net. You gotta find a way to convert on it, but you have to be aware of where the goaltender is. You don't have much time, you have to have quick hands, but you have to find the back of the net when there's not much room. In the final moments of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Toronto's won the draw. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Sends it in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Camps won the face-off. Right now, let's see what they can do. Hammers 
to go. Both teams will recharge and be back with more on ice action in the second in no time. Fans back in their seats. Teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. The Leafs have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Puck scooped up by Sider. Quick feed to the brinket. Fantastic save! Grabs it in his own end. Takes it into the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Let's it go! And that goes off a player. Rips it and rips it! Good save! How did he get a piece of it? They are really pouring the pressure here. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. Center and feed! Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Scores! And that's three unanswered goals. And as my mom likes to say, they're cooking with gas. <laughs> they're cooking with gas. And you can expect that they have put their opponents on their heels. This is a team that knows that they've worn their opponent down. Now they've got to keep the pedal to the metal. Enjoying things in twos. Here in period number two, they've gone up by two, Cheryl. There's been a lot of twos, James, and they'd love to get another couple goals to really pad the stats and increase their lead. But right now, it's about habits, not giving their opponent any life in this game. Shot! That one misses and will play on. Well, you spend so much time trying to create scoring chances, and when you do, you've got to find the back of the net. At the very least, hit it, James. Wait a second, James. I believe there's going to be a call right there. And in fact, Happens. Oh, it's not a popular one of the ICD officials here. Our first opportunity to look at the power play unit set to go to work. We're getting their first power play opportunity in the game, and here comes the top power play unit in the league. They're so dangerous and effective. It is extremely difficult to fend against them. Huck picked up by Giordano. Moves it to Cobb. A chance to clear. Here's a short pass to Giordano. Loses his balance on the play. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Toronto got the puck. Passes it in front. Can't get it to go. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Receives the pass. Moves it quickly over to Domi. Tries to the crease. Scores on the man and finishing for one hole. And this is on specialty teams. James, you can see that good movement to open up lane just to swept the box there. And they're able to cash it in.
The Leafs can do no wrong this evening, especially in the offensive zone here, Cheryl. Well, the score is a testament to the way they've been playing. I mean, they've been dominating in the offensive zone. They've had the puck on their stick. They're driving play, but they've been really urgent, even with the lead here. A great game for them so far. And he takes the feed. Huso is a competitor, and he is not afraid to compete for every single puck and outwill and outbattle his opponent. And that highlight reel save, it is something, James, because just when you think it's almost in, he finds a way to get to that puck. Such an athletic goaltender. And that's just out of reach. Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. Steps inside the line. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. And he takes a shot. Oh, great save and a beauty on the play. Samsonov's been solid here tonight, James. I mean, look at his save percentage. He's been excellent between the crease, and that's making the saves that you need to and you want to at the appropriate moment. Man, his team's been effective going north. Nice zone entry from the left. Sends it over to Sider. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. The Red Wings gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Oh, great reflex pass stopped by Samsonov. Colton has spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. And now it's grabbed by Sider. Handles the pass from the right wing. And they continue to apply pressure here. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Samsonov. I love that he swallowed this one up with his glove. It's a real threat coming from the slot area. No rebound to boot. Detroit's got to find a way to stop chasing the game, and the first thing they can do is start attacking and pounding the puck. You have to have it if you want to find a way to put it in. Takes a shot, and that carries off a body in the lane. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it's but he had to get the one-timer off quickly, James, because he didn't have much time and space in that net front area. You know that they're going to close quickly on you when you find that that puck comes across. The Leafs are showing no signs of slowing down, and here we are in the late stages of period number two. They continue to hit down the accelerator. Yeah, and the coach must be loving this. I mean, sometimes you can't put your finger on exactly why it's working the way it is, but the chemistry is off the charts here, and they've got a comfortable lead. Taken along the wall by Marner. Quick shot! Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Detroit's got possession of the puck. Tries to get the puck to Rasmussen. The Red Wings carry it along the wall. And player hauled down to the ice. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up here. The Leafs are getting two minutes for tripping. Clean sheet of ice. Two down. One to go. Third period. They're ready to drop the puck. The Red Wings go right back at it on the power play here and win the draw to start the frame. Oh, he got rocked and tucked right into the opposition bench pounder. Uh -huh, and half the bench is up, right? They want to see what the heck's going on. And on the other side, he's in the line his opponent. You gotta collect yourself and get out of there. Can't hang on after that hit. Jabs the puck away. Nice zone entry from the middle. He's got a step. Oh, denies him on the play. Uh, and this is a great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. 
Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. Larkins won the draw there on the attack. Scooped up along the wall by Brody. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Cuts to the point. Scores! Well, how's that for killing a penalty? That's turning a PK into a power kill, James. Not just shooting it down the ice. You have time and space. Take advantage with a shorty. And he gets his shot off the most coveted area on the ice, right in front of the paint. Doesn't allow the boy to get set up and puts it home. The Leafs are sending a clear message that they are not taking their foot off the gas in this third period here, Cheryl. Well, you can certainly tell that they bought into the game plan, and the coach is certainly ecstatic with the performance of the entire bench. I mean, look at the way they're moving and holding the puck, attacking the net at the right times. It has been a seamless effort. Now a quick pass to Sider. And he takes the feed. Answered the call there. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Great pressure on the offensive end by Tavares. Puck grab by Larkin. Quick feed to McCabe. Tavares carries the puck in his own zone. Huge steal in his own end. The Red Wings looking against the half wall. Great defensive effort, breaking up the pass. Taken by Giordano. There's a great close save by Reimer. Toronto's number one line has been dominant tonight, James. They've been in the offensive zone. They've created a ton of opportunities, and they're a reason why they're in the lead. Grabs the puck. Oh, textbook put check to turn that over. Tries to feed it over to Fabry. Oh, he hit him and got all of it. Oh, and that's a tough one, James. You're along the boards. They don't have a lot of give. What that means, you're feeling it all. The Red Wings will play it in their own end. Works it across to Fabry. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Knocked away by Sherratt. Looks to get the puck over to Fisher. Break away! And he makes the save. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. Shot! Scores! All over the rebound and tucks it in for the goal. James, these are the kind of pesky goals that create a ton of energy for your team. The rebound pops out after the shot. You have to have the hard stick and heavy on it. With it on the ice, bad one to keep for it. He does it, he buries it. The Leafs are having themselves a night. They probably don't want this one to end, Pounder. Yeah, I wouldn't. If you're patting the stats and you're putting up these kind of numbers, I mean, from start to finish, they've imposed their will on their opponent. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Detroit's got it in their own zone. Puck scooped up by Kent. Here's a chance. Oh, a clutch save. Busted stick on the play. These equipment managers got big budgets now, though, Cheryl. Well, they got big budgets, but it doesn't seem like they last, does it, James? I mean, no. look at that one. It just ricochets and snaps in two. Crazy. The Leafs have shown no signs of slowing down here in this third period. Oh, big. Jones won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. And he takes the dish. Costin's lugging the puck. Play rolls on. The Leafs have it against the wall. And now it's Kadomi. Centering feed. And he denies that great opportunity there. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Misses a golden opportunity there. Detroit's creating a ton of scoring chances in this game, but unable to capitalize, a reason why they're trailing. The Red Wings take possession on the defensive end. Feeds it across the ice to Raymond. Looks to set up at the point now. And there's another stop. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is, and it's by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. Nice save from point blank range. Played big in the moment there. 
Puck picked up by Perron. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Moves it to Tavares. Poked away at center ice. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. To the low slide! from that low zone slot area. James just beats the goaltender because he gets off his stick so fast. The Leafs have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. Picked up along the boards by Nylander. tonight a lot of scoring chances and they lead it late in this third period the red wings win it and as the final seconds tick off the clock the home fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight